Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Shore Regional is brought to you by Monmouth Medical Center in Long Branch. Two state field hockey powers tangle on the Jersey Shore. Point Pleasant Borough is the defending Shore Conference champion, the Panthers hosting Shore Regional. The Blue Devils lost to Point Borough twice last year, including the Shore Conference championship game. Shore with a 1-0 lead at the half on a Mariel Montenegro goal. Point Borough spent most of the third quarter in Shore's defensive end. Great scoring chance here, but Molly Schultz gets the stick down and makes a tremendous defensive play. Look at how close the Panthers come to scoring, but Schultz keeps this a 1-0 Blue Devils lead. Late in the third, Point Borough on the penalty corner. Shore goalie Tegan Harmon comes out to cut down the angle. Harmon's outstanding play was thanks to real aggressive plays like this. We head to the fourth quarter. It stays 1-0 Shore. Point Borough dominated in shots on goal. Another penalty corner, another Harmon stop. Once again, she's out from the cage to cut down the angle. Tegan Harmon had 18 saves. Shore Regional had just four shots on goal for the entire game, but boy, they made them count. Junior Emma Haynes with the shot. It's through the five hole for a Blue Devils goal. Haynes is jumping for joy and with good reason. Four shots, two goals for Shore, make it a two nothing game. Take another look. Finley Elias is camped out in front of the net. She's able to screen the goalie, and that allows Haynes to score a critical goal in the fourth quarter. That's because with under three minutes to go, Point Burrow breaks through. Haley Fox with the shot. Kylie Rapaski on the redirect goes top shelf for the goal. 2.59 to go in the fourth. We've got a 2-1 game. But the Panthers could not find the equalizer in the closing seconds, and Shore Regional comes through with a huge early season win. 2-1 is your final. We could see these two teams again in the Shore Conference Tournament. The 12th ranked team in New Jersey knocks off number eight. Emma Haynes and Tegan Harmon talk about the big W. Uh, I just think we worked really hard this whole entire summer and these past couple days. I think we just really wanted it a lot. So we just gave it all we got and we didn't get a lot of shots, but we made them count. <sighs> them beating us on our home turf last year, we really had a mission. We've been saying all season that we're gonna go from two to one this year. And I think we showed that we are the team to do that. We showed that today. In Point Pleasant, Humbridge Crampanis for JerseySportsZone.com.